I was still in this, I want to live in poverty mindset. I want to be an agorist and I'm going to struggle and I'm going to struggle and I'm going to struggle. And the past year I started reflecting on that and realizing I made that choice, that choice of poverty, because I thought that that was how I could change the world. But you don't change the world by by being without. You change the world through abundance hmm. and by being able to attract and manifest whatever you need, wherever you go, and to make choices in your life. That is freedom. And so <laughs> my grandmother passing, it, it just it, – it changed me. And I will tell you, the past month – we have tapped into this abundance mindset and we are no longer going to live in poverty. We are no longer going to live a life of stress and, and, and hitting the grind and workaholicism and, um, you know, short tempers and, and, and fear. We were in fear. It's, mm. And so when you are allowing that into your space, when you're allowing people who are toxic into your most intimate space, your business, your family, your relationships, you become that and you cannot succeed. And so we cut out all the toxicity. We told the world we needed help and boom, abundance. It's there. And I'm not letting go of that. I am not going to live in fear anymore. I'm not going to live in poverty anymore. I am going to change the world and I'm going to do it by helping others step into abundance. We don't have to let the gangster banksters be the only people who have resources. Mm. They're there. You just have to open yourself to it and quit living in doubt and fear.